Okay, y'all can pause. There's no need to look at any other tapes because you found the next person that's going to be on Survivor. It's me. My name is Tyler Barbour. I'm 19 years old, and right now I'm going to Rutgers, New Brunswick in New Jersey. I'm going to be the next youngest winner of Survivor, and I know I can win this because I'm a boss-ass bitch. Basically, to talk a little bit about myself personality-wise, I'm obviously a little sassy, um, a little over the top, and... I mean, I'm down to have to do fun things and like hang out and be with friends. I mean, people either love me or hate me. It's mainly due because, you know, I'm really out there. I'm really outgoing. But some people just judge me right off the bat. And they could hate me and be like, all right, hey, girl, what's up? But then deep down in my head, I'm like, all right, bitch, like, you suck. I don't want to talk to you. But, you know, I could put on that face, that two-faced, which is good in Survivor because you have to be a little two-faced. And I'm down to do that. And I do that on a daily basis. Um, other than that... I fit that in that 18 to 21 year old range, that archetype that you guys always cast, where the players never know what the fuck to do and usually go really far and get no votes or get voted off early. That's not going to be me. You need somebody that goes balls to the wall and goes hard, which is exactly what I do. Basically, I work two jobs while also going to school. One, I work at McDonald's. And I know you're like, well, that's barely a job. Well, bitch, get it right because fast food is fucking annoying and it's hard to do. And I work with crazy ass people, which I know are the people that I'm going to have to work with on the island. So perfect. I'm ready for that. Second of all, I work at a bank where people are twice my age and three times my age. And I'm pretty cool with them. Like, I'm like, hey, Martha, like, how you doing? Like, we connect. And so I talk to them on a daily basis. So I work with the older people while also working with the crazy people. So I'm perfect. I'm ready for Survivor. I'm ready to work with anybody and the reason why I work so hard is because I'm kind of an individual like I kind of like, do things by myself away from my family not because I don't like them or anything but you know I found out at a young age that I'm gay and I feel like once you figure that out you kind of grow and progress as a person individually because you don't really connect with anybody else at least for me so I never really needed my handheld for anything which is why I worked two jobs while also going to school I paid for my car in full I paid for my insurance and I paid for all my gas I paid for everything that I want so if I want something I work to go get it and I feel like that's a good skill for survival. like you need to work hard me I'm going on that island and I'm working hard from day one that's what you need to do as a young kid people need to respect you from beginning to end and that's how I'm going to play. Other than that, um, I don't need my handheld, like I said, for anything. I'm a person that does things for myself. And so just this year, I saved up enough money to go to Costa Rica with just me and my friend. No parents, no anything. And we had a bomb ass time. And I feel like you need that kind of go-getterness, that kind of like outside exploration to really go hard and survive and really play good. And I know I can kill it. I'm not like every other 19-year-old. I'm ready to fucking play this game so that my hotline bling. And let's get this shit done, because I'm the number one Survivor fan, and I'm going to win that shit. Get ready.